Contemporary art in the Ukrainian avant-garde. A one-man show of Petro Boyko, an artist who became famous all over the world for his startling vision and vivid images, was presented in the capital. The show was organized in a creative manner. The chosen location was a derelict tuberculosis hospital and homeless and vulnerable people were invited to the opening. You have a very unusual show today. What is the concept of it? The concept is in everything. The whole world around us, a synthesis of everything. Everything. Can you tell us a little about yourself? I understand your life has not been easy. My story is simple. I collected artworks in a small way and I loved art in general. I was drinking and partying too much, ending up with the delirium tremens. We are inside a derelict tuberculosis hospital and I believe it is not by chance. What was your intention? When people are seriously ill for a long time, they tend to think of the concept of life and death. This is why we chose this location. Though Petro Boyko absorbs some elements of Ukrainian avant-garde, his own strong style predominates. The artist creates abstract compositions using bright colors, geometric shapes and lines. His works are recognizable and unique. Boyko's paintings look equally at home in museums around the world, in private collections and in unconventional places such as this hospital. I have been observing Boyko's art for 10 years. We visited him in Priluki some time ago at his creative base. What are your impressions? Each painting leaves very pleasant impression. It's wonderful, it's unsurpassed, it's positive, it's nice to look at and I want to bring my children and relatives to see it. Please tell us why you are here today, why we are interested in coming. My friend invited me and I was interested to see something beautiful and positive, so I came to visit. Did you like it? Yes, very much, I think. It's strange and interesting. Why do you think the artist has organized the show in such a place? Well, only an artist can understand an artist. And we ordinary people can't understand everything. Let's just say that it's really interesting, unusual, it's not a classic exhibition. It's more like an installation. I haven't seen anything like this for a long time. What did you like the most? The rooster. Do you think this sort of contemporary art is appropriate now? It is a very unusual concept. I don't know. I haven't seen anything like this for a long time. It makes this place beautiful. I would like it to stay here. Do you live here? Yes, I live here. You live here in this hospital? Yes, I do. The guests appreciated the show. They are not only close to the artist's work, but also to the artist's way of life. Petro Boyko faced many difficulties, but despite that, he never stopped creating masterpieces. When his hometown was under occupation and there was no electricity or heating in his studio, the artist still painted and glorified Ukraine all over the world. Art in my head, my take.